Now, the national government has announced plans to use the Kenya Navy vessels to transport fuel to Lamu, which is inaccessible by road after it was cut off at Gamba along the Garsen Lamu Road by floods. Fuel currently is running out, and in some parts of the, can, uh, of the, ca of the county, there is already no petrol. Now, Health Cabinet Secretary Susan Nakumicha and Government Spokesman Isaac Maura, who toured Lamu with two principal secretaries on Wednesday, announced that the military will be used to transport the essential commodity. Unlike foodstuff, which can be loaded on a boat at the cutoff area, petrol cannot. At the same time, the government cl clarified that the cholera outbreak, as reported, was not serious as out of 113 cases, only 63 tested positive so far. In the last 24 hours, five deaths have been reported raising flood-related toll to 165 Kenyans. We do send our sincere condolences and sympathies to grieving families, and Kenyans should remain vigilant and comply with alerts and cooperate with our evacuation teams to avert more deaths and injuries. Pole kwa wale wa Kenya tuliopoteza, wamefika mia moja sitini na tano lakini um, uh, waziri hapa lamu tumebahatika na ninawashukuru wale wote ambao wanahusika hapa lamu hatujapoteza hata mtu mmoja na natumai hatutapoteza mtu we have other places like Garissa that the road was completely cut off that has been fixed so here it is on the priority list in fact we shared the cake nationally the available resources were shared within the committee. And the one that was given the highest allocation was infrastructure, so that the roads can be rehabilitated and maintained. Because if the road is not working, medicine will not arrive. Now, the newly commissioned 3.2 billion shillings West Valley Sugar Factory in Kericho is 